welcome back to G.I. Joe News. Last time we chatted was about the His Tank 26,000 backers, excellent stuff. And since then there's been some more reveals and pipeline figures of some characters coming into the G.I. Joe classified line. And we'll talk about some Super 7 characters as well. But also in the news recently there has been the YouTuber in the G.I. Joe community who's ruffling feathers once again. <laughs> Doesn't ruffle my feathers because I've been doing this a long time and nothing kind of phases me. Of course I get negative stuff like every YouTuber does, but this particular YouTuber who has made a video all about the State of the Union has decided to clap back at all the, the trolls, the haters. Here's the thing. This guy thinks we're all trolls and haters. I, I feel like I'm part of that group of people as well that he's hating on. We're not trolling you, we're questioning you. Because every time something comes up where you've said something, we get in the comment section, we say, where'd you get this information from? You delete the video, you delete the comment. <laughs> People are like wondering what's going on. This is why you get called out for being odd. You get a lot of names, there's your channel right there. I haven't said your name. I think a long time ago you had 300 subscribers and I subscribed to you and said, Check this guy out. Now, I don't think I can say that. I don't think I can give you my support anymore. But if you're a viewer of my channel and you still subscribe to him, that's okay. I, I don't mind at all, you know? Watch us all. I'm, it's up to the viewer. It's not up to me to say that. Some of the G.I. Joe YouTubers who are part of the community who I want to give a shout out to, The Elite Legend, The Art of Shark, Toy Habits, Iron Can, all on the bad boys list. <laughs> now they're, they're great fellas, they do their thing, I do my thing, we talk G.I. Joes. So when it comes to that guy, that's all I have to say about that. The memes will speak for themselves. Moving on, so let's do that right now. I want to tell you about the entire run of characters. From 1 through to about 31, you are all aware of, there's the picture of them. I'm going to run through with all the images of the figures from 32 through to as far as we can possibly go. Number 32 is Barbecue. Number 33 is the Bat. Number 34, the Alley Viper. Number 35, Storm Shadow. Number 36, Spirit. Number 37, Cobra Officer. Number 38, Croc Master. Number 39, Outback Tiger Force. Number 40, Tiger Force Duke with the Ram. Number 41, a Python Bat. Number 42 is a Python Viper. Number 43, Dr. Mindbender. Number 44, Tomax. Number 45, Zemo. Number 46, Stalker. Number 47 is the Viper 3 pack. Number 48 is Zorana. Number 49 is Dusty. Number 50 is the Crimson Guard. Number 51, Blue Ninja 2-Pack. Number 52, Snake Eyes and Timber. Number 53, Sergeant Slaughter. Number 54, Bazooka. Number 55, Rakondo. Those two, Tiger Force. Number 56, Python Patrol Officer. Number 57, Serpentor. Number 58, 59 and 60, haven't been designated a character yet. Number 61 is Kamakura. And the five characters that we've seen proper digital rendings of are Cover Girl, Lieutenant Falcon, Outback, Crimson Bat, and the Barbecue Marauders style. Our pipeline reveals they start off as Rock and Roll, Shipwreck, Copperhead, Torpedo, Snowjob, Tunnel Rat, Grunt, Scrap Iron, Deluxe Version, Ripper, Firefly, Low Light, Big Ben, Range Viper, Tele Viper with a Trouble Bubble Flight Pod Vehicle. Most of those characters will take us into 2024. Let me know your thoughts on all of those. There's, a, there's an absolute ton of them. Doesn't look like we're going to have any leaks because they've already told us what the pipeline figures are coming. <laughs> they stopped the YouTubers from speculating and leaking all the content out there. Also, I want to talk about Super 7. As you know, they've got a new wave recently released. And I'll start with the two waves of six, which are Meh, they're all right. Green shirts, check them out. As you know, they've got six different varieties of the exact same character. 
army build them all day long or leave them on card back. Female Cobra Troopers. Let me know your thoughts on those ones. Once again, six very different girls, all Cobra Troopers. Then the cool ones coming. Zartan, Cobra Commander, Shipwreck, Abat, Cover Girl, Snake Eyes with his covert snakeling outfit. Pretty damn cool. I have picked up the Major Blood. He's up on the wall with the rest of the original retros, but of course Super 7. They've got plenty of characters. I'm very happy with that. Hopefully Hasbro catches up with some O-Rings and starts getting them out soon. Awesome stuff. Thank you for today's video. Let me know your thoughts down below. I hope you're happy that I've got the big list out there so they're all I've missed any. We're all up to date. We've talked about them all. <laughs> Thanks for watching and here's my outro. Thanks for watching. My name is Usual Mike. If you enjoy this content, consider being a member of the channel and hit that join button below. You might like to pick something up from Amazon in the affiliates link down below. And also there is a link to my Redbubble store so you can pick up some merch with my logos on it. If you want to follow me on social media, I'm on Twitter at usualmike30 or on Instagram at usualmike.tv. And if you haven't done so already, hit subscribe, tap that little bell for notifications, slap a like on the video if you've enjoyed it. And I'll see you guys next time. All the best.